morning. This is Nita with the Timepiece Garden. Panda is doing perimeter checks because that's what she does. And I'm in here to uh, harvest some more greens. Cut and come again. Got my big bucket today. Um, I won't be taking from the first three buckets here because those are the ones I took from last time. Not that you can tell the difference, but that's why they're cut and come again. Um, definitely going to take some from that one. He's overflowing the pot. Probably these two over here. You know, kind of always give somebody the opportunity to take a break while I'm harvesting everybody else. And I have one that's, uh, one that's giving me berries. I'll be picking those two. Yummy. Talk to you in a few. Something else I got to do while I'm out here. The uh, parsnip. You can see where they're, they're starting to turn colors. Time to start harvesting seed heads. You know? You can see that one's gotten nice and dark. They're ready for start harvesting, which is a good thing. Some of them still aren't. Some of them are still very much in bloom. Hey, have blooms on them. Life is awesome. Talk to you in a few. So the next thing we're going to do this morning while it's still cool is pick blackberries. First one's in the bucket. And then um, I realized I almost stepped on him. Scared him to death. Or she. She's just hanging out. She's slowly but surely poking her head back out. So we're going to kind of walk on. Most of these here are still kind of red. And, uh, you know, uh, Pick a different section over here, maybe. See if there's any over here. Um, I'm going to go down the driveway this morning. Um, I have a lot, because I've picked over here a couple times, a handful at a time. I don't expect to see a lot. You notice there's only one in the bucket. Um, but the driveway has got several that are too, too tall for the rabbits to get to. So um, we're walking the driveway this morning. Hi, Kitty Blaze. How you doing? What you doing? Don't you being silly? Hi, Kitty. All right, with that, it's time to go get started. And we will all talk to you later. Those are my choke cherries. I mean, they're ripe, but they're really bitter. So unless you're going to harvest them and make like a pie, so you can add six cups of sugar, um... You know, not for the table. But you can see the cherry leaves. You can see the, um, you have to look at the stem back there. There's cherry bark, you know. Anyway, just thought I'd share. Isn't that awesome? This is just one bush. I'll be back. Those are all blackberries, just not ripe. And again, everything up here, this is all too tall for the, the rabbits to get to. And they go over there at the tree, and this is just one of the bushes, um, which is why I decided I wanted to come do it. I'm going to see if I can walk the driveway and hit them all. Um, mostly because next week it's workout blueberries, workout corn, workout. So it'll be, you know next Saturday before I can come out and do it again. So a lot of these that are red right now will be fully ripe next week. So, today is just a start. Alright, off to go down the road. Talk to you in a few. Cows made Kitty Blaze a little nervous. He's like, I've never been down the driveway this far. He's like, Mama, what is it? What is it? And it's like, it's all right, kitty blaze. It's just the cows. This is one of my more shadier spots. And you can tell they're still all just deep green. I have a very long harvest season because of the shade and sun. Meow. I know. I know. It's kind of awesome, huh? He's like, I'm hot. It's the first time Kitty's walked the driveway with us. He thinks we were on a pride hunt and he was allowed to come along. 
Say we're we're not quite back yet. He's like, I'm just gonna lay here and die. Alright, let's get on walking. Talk to you in a few. So if you've watched any of my prior prior videos, yeah, words help when I have them. That's what's left of that uh big old wasp nest. Now you know I call them tracker jackers. It's just hunger games, it's funny. Um, huge nest. It's been ripped in half, so I'm assuming that the the hell that jacked up my tomatoes busted it open, which is a good thing for me because that means they'll move. You know, they won't stay there. Yay, go live somewhere else. <sighs> Just madness. I don't know if the the white shows across the bottom where the the babies were. All right. Kitty Blaze is like, yeah, we're taking a break. Find a shady spot. Just hang out. It's like this was a useless, you know, pride hunt. We didn't catch anything. 